I thought the Spanish production of the Piper's Lurie side, Los Illuminados, was beautiful, fantastic. Um, they, it was the exact same story that I had written. Uh, they went a completely different, they traveled a different road with it entirely uh, to end up at the exact same destination. The way they used the lights to create a, a shadowy effect was astonishing in its beauty. And uh, they mined some of the smallest moments that I didn't necessarily intend to uh, have great significance. Uh, and they turned it into something that was uh, very significant and memorable. Uh, I was I was so happy and excited to to have seen it and to have been there with the Spanish audience that was laughing at the same stuff that the American audience was laughing at and uh, enjoying it. Uh, it was the exact same energy that I felt in New York when I was watching the play for the first time five years ago. Well, uh, the state of uh, independent theater in the U.S. in in, in some ways is as it, as in anything. In some ways, it's. Uh, a lot better and otherwise it's a lot worse and it's a lot worse because obviously uh, grants are shrinking, funding shrinking with these economic times. Um, however, with the internet, um, it's easy for a young, it's easier for a young company to get their name out there to uh, promote their work. You don't necessarily need one of the big papers to vet you to be able to uh, build an audience. Uh, you just need to get a little bit of cash together and uh, rent out a spot and let the internet, you know, kind of do the rest. You know. Intellectual property is tricky because oftentimes um, you have some higher power that's trying to exploit, uh, you know, a worker who wasn't really paid well to begin with. So it's kind of like you're ripping them off after you've already ripped them off. Uh, as that pertains to me, since I have my own theater company and I own the rights to the plays, uh, I, I'm neither uh, a victim nor a victimizer. It's just an opportunity for me to uh, to kind of grow an audience, uh, theaters of the moment, and that moment relates to time and space. So people don't really get to see the work unless they're in the room with you. So to be able to make it downloadable, um, you know, the only thing I would really need to make sure of is that the actors don't feel like they're getting ripped off. But then again, I'm giving it away for free. And any time you're giving away something for free, uh, I don't think too many people have a problem with it, especially if they're trying to promote their own careers. If I was to charge money for a download and then keep it all for myself, I'm sure there'd be some unhappy actors. But I'm not doing that. I'm just trying to sh share the work uh, and get more people excited about theater even though they'll be looking at it on their computer. <laughs> <laughs>